I came out to shoot hubby's content for Valentino. This is not part of the shoot. Did you go chasing a squirrel? Nah, I just, there's a path down there, so I'm kind of curious to see where I was leading. So I was like, let's have an exercise today and see how far I can get down there and these loafers. <laughs> I got pretty far. You thought I was chasing squirrels. No, I was doing more than that. Hey guys, I'm heading to the mall, so I'm just trying to look put together. Um, I'm not going to do anything crazy on my face, but I am going to just look put together, you know what I mean? Also, I got my red, so if you see a pimple here, just ignore it. I've been cramping all day, it's ridiculous, like... I just changed the camera to the Sony ZV-1. My outfit, I'm wearing this Boohoo Man sweater. It's literally from my husband's closet. It's oversized, as you can tell. This headband is from Amazon. The bag is just a regular bag from H&M. And my sweatpants are also from H&M, and I'm wearing my Uggs today. I'll be spending this weekend with you guys, so hope you're ready. And let's get this party started. Good morning, my loves. Heading out to a yoga class, just literally in my building. They have like a new yoga instructor and they want to do like a free class, which I'm excited about. So outfit check. I'm wearing this scarf that I got from Massimo DT. And by the way, if you see me wearing scarves, I'm trying to really go back to my hijabi journey. So yeah, enjoy. Um, this jacket is from Amazon. My leggings are from Fabletics. And then let me just show you guys the perfume of the day. Also, the sun is like in and out. One second. Perfume of the day. It is from Replica, from the garden. The notes are earth, tomato, and leaves. And I just, I feel like it just goes with the vibe right now. I need to pack a bag, my Pilates socks, because I just don't want to slide off. They're just so cute. <laughs> so I'm going to take this bag with me, and inside it is my camera. I will try and vlog a little bit. I have this lip gloss from the lip bar and lotion from Dior, and my house keys. For my shoes, I'm just going to wear my Yeezy slides because it's literally in the building. And... My yoga mat is from Amazon. Let's grab the bag. Always running late, so let's go. I am not sure if I can do my makeup and catch up right now, but I just wanted to pop on quickly to let you guys know that I am heading out to the city I'm going to New York to a YSL event, which I'm super excited because I don't think I've ever been to a YSL event. So this is my first one and I did decide to share that blessing and invite one of my girlfriends. So yeah. Oh no. See? See? No way I can get ready and chat. I'm just going to catch up with you guys later. Literally. So many Looks good, put together. I knew I was forgetting something. I have not used my 
benefit brow. Just set my brows up. That's much better. Period. Um, this is bothering me, but it's fine because I'm just going to throw it in the washer. And just like that, I am done. Let's get dressed. Okay, so I'm dressed. I decided to wear an all black look. Let me give you guys the deets. So this turban, um, by the way, I am in my turban Jalabia era. I don't even know how to explain it, but I'm absolutely loving it. I know it's not to perfection, but I have to keep practicing to make sure I get what I love. But the turban was a gift for my sister when I went to Kenya. It's like a jersey material. Pretty sure I can find it on Amazon and I'm just gonna link it for you guys. I decided to throw on this Bottega dupe earrings from Akan that I always talk about. You know, I have the silver and the gold. Decided to wear the silver because this jacket um, that I'm wearing, the blazer, has silver like buttons and stuff like that. So the blazer is from Nades. Um, it's a black owned brand that I worked with some time back. And the top I'm wearing underneath is from Express. Very good material. And it's perfect for layering in the spring season, especially like when it's a little bit chilly. Um, Wearing this belt, this is a Celine dupe from Amazon, and then my jeans are from H&M. They are a recent pickup, actually. And then for my perfume, and then for my perfume of the day, I'm going to wear this perfume. Kind of feels like it fits the vibe because it's like going to a YSL event, smelling like YSL. Yeah, <laughs> you get the point. <laughs> then for my bag, I'm gonna use my Alma BB today. I feel like I haven't used her in a minute. Inside it, I have my camera, hand lotion, pocket size mirror, and then I have my card reader. Card reader, card holder. This is it, it's just so cute. The Fenty Gloss, this is the hot cherry. I absolutely love this. I don't think I'm gonna take the straps for the Alma BB, but this is the vibe I'm going for. Very, you know, sophisticated, casual, smart. My girlfriend's already here, so ciao. This one I can do Hey my loves, I am back home and let me tell you is this focused yeah the event was so fire smiling so hard because i had such a good time like i love going with michaela anywhere she's such a sweetheart listen this face beat is still sitting like i never stepped out it's crazy i sprayed it so much with the urban decay spray i don't know if i filmed that but it's put it all together and because i didn't wear any glasses there's no like glass dent like shades dent so it's perfect it's been dewy and it's been serving me right so of course i had to get straight into my body because what like body is just a must-have at home like i have so many of these now and i'm just like yes i need more and i wrapped my scarf um still trying to figure things out but i wrapped it this way i kind of like it it's a vibe um as you can see from this view right here, I do have a couple of things I wanna unbox with you guys. I did get a beautiful gift from Ryan at the YSL event. This is just so sweet. Like I just, I can't. The blessings, alhamdulillah. This is so beautiful. So um, he curated like a couple of things for me and my plus one and it was, it just felt so special. I was just like, wow, taking it all in. I even have a gift for my husband in here. Like, wow. Um, let's start with the little boxes. Ooh. I just dropped everything in there. The first thing is this perfume. This is why I sell myself. I'm actually going to give this to my husband because it is uh, a male scent. It's like the male version of um, why I sell Libre. This is how the bottle looks like. It smells so good. This is gonna be the second time I give this to my husband. I gifted him his first one and he loved it. So I'm so glad I, I'm able to refill this for him. He's gonna love it. He's not home yet, so he's gonna see this when he comes home. Next up is the YSL Libre. This, I already opened this as well. This is the YSL Libre, the original one. I absolutely love that. I'm a fan of the Intense, so I do plan on gifting this as well. And then, something very exciting is this lip and cheek balm tint. I love blushes, so this was 
the first thing I saw and I was so excited. I've never used YSL blushes. Oh my God, the pigment, it just looks so nice. I don't even know how he knew my shade, but he nailed it. Thank you so much again. This is the color and I am already obsessed with it. I cannot wait to try this, honestly. This is not like the one I've used before because it has a blue, it has a blue, um, like where the label is, is blue. The one I have is gold. But my girlfriend, Michaela said she used it and she's like, it's better than the original one. I'm actually excited to use this because I no longer do lashes. And if I do them, it's once in a while. I'm trying to grow my own lashes. Um, next is this beautiful lip gloss. I think these are lipsticks. What are these? Oh, the YSL Love Shine. It has high shine, carrying lipstick. And then there's a balm. How pretty is that? I don't know what they put on my lips earlier on. I think I took a picture. I definitely want that color because it looks so good on me. More YSL lippies, why not? And lastly, a smaller version of the original Lash Clash. This is like the one I have, but I have the bigger one, this one. And then next we have this little cute goodie bag, cute little lipsticks, and there's something else in here. This is the Glow In Balm. It's like a, like a sample size. Then wait, there's this lipsticks that I think is just so cute. I think those are so cute. But I did get intrigued by this color. This color, I need to get the full size of this. So they did send me two, two things and we're gonna go through them together. The first one is the latest scent that pays tribute to the icons of YSL, Runway, the Libre, Intense, yes! Remember I was saying I love the Intense? So it came in this box, I'm just ripping it up. Oh my God. I'm speechless. I absolutely love the Intense and I've never had this size. It's just so cute and petite. Thank you so much YSL Beauty. Oh, let's spray her. Mm. 10 out of 10 minus nothing. Thank you so much YSL. And more goodies is in here. What is this? Guys, it's giving a whole wide. <laughs> YSL was like, you are our girl. Okay, so this is Touche Eclat Awakening Click Pen that gives you eight hours of beauty rest in just one click. What? These are the shades I picked. Love the packaging, so cute. I'm not sure what shade is my color. I think that's why they sent me two. But what? What? Before I continue, I just wanna say thank you so much, YSL Beauty. I absolutely love you guys and I cannot wait to share in depth about these products um yeah that's i'm gonna take it all in like i feel i i really remember when i started content creating i'm just really grateful to you guys without you guys i wouldn't even be here with my content journey so thank you so much for supporting i know my youtube doesn't get a lot of views but i feel like the people that do tune in i appreciate each and every one of you guys and i i already promised you guys i will do better except the only thing that happened in between that conversation and now is i was fasting so there's not been that much energy for me to be putting in work i was taking this ramadan more in than usual like not thinking about social media and just taking it all in and getting all the benefits of ramadan and praying for my loved ones praying for myself and all of that stuff you know what i mean so i kind of i took it all in i've really been enjoying this ramadan it's been such a good spiritual journey and it's it's been nice it's been nice it's been quick but um yeah i just feel truly blessed alhamdulillah and i hope and pray you guys get the same feeling I have and even more. Like I hope whatever you're working on really comes you know, to life. And I hope if you're a creator and you're just starting out your journey, just know that if you put in the work and you're very aligned with yourself, that's why I'm kind of going back, not kind of, I'm back to the hijab because, or the turban or like more modest fashion because that's who I truly am. I want to dress how I grew up dressing up. Like I don't want to get farther away from myself from my faith and from my beliefs which sums up to who i am i feel like i've been rebellious for the past four years i've just been like oh i'm taking out my hijab i'm taking out my scarf and i'm wearing my booty shorts well, i don't really wear booty shorts but i'm wearing short stuff and i'm gonna be outside but i'm tired now and I, and that's why i'm saying god loves us all like i feel so lucky to even get this opportunity to try and correct my mistakes yeah not everybody sees that, you know what I mean? Not everybody gets to experience that. So that alone, I am gravitating and rooting my energy and my 
source from there because the fact that I can see how lucky I am to even get this opportunity to mend my life and create the life I want for myself and, and just make necessary, necessary adjustments, that's major. Some people die before they do that. So if you're watching this, that means you're alive. So be grateful, be thankful. Tomorrow's another day. Each and every day you can better yourself. And I do not know how we got to this conversation, but we're here. And I don't think I'm gonna cut this out. So I hope you guys um, understand what I, where I'm coming from and yeah um, thanks for my TED talk <laughs> anyways let's open the rest of the PRs I'm gonna be quick with this one thank you so much Miss Arabian for sending me this gorgeous scent um, this honestly came in a few days ago I have already been loving one but I'm gonna go through each one of them real quick and then we're gonna go in depth about it on another video when I speak about perfume collections for spring and um, yeah the first one is Oud Azraq Oud Azraq is very masculine to me. I feel this is a perfume that's honestly best suited for uh, a man. So I'm gifting this to my husband. He already loves it. He smelt it and he was like, absolutely 10 out of 10. Ooh, smells very masculine, but I absolutely love this on my husband. So I am gifting this to him. And we're gonna, we're gonna talk more details about the notes and stuff on another video. So we're just gonna quickly go through it as the PR packages. Next one is Oud Ahmar. This is actually a very gorgeous scent. Absolutely stunning. I haven't really used this much. I've only sprayed it the first day I got it and I already love it. And I wanna talk more about um, my perfume, latest perfume obsessions in a different video. But I just wanted to share with you guys that is from Swiss Arabian Oud Ahmar. If you are into floral scents, fresh vanilla gourmand kind of thing, you gonna like her. Then lastly, they sent me this Rose 01. Let me tell you, you will know that I'm obsessed with this perfume because look at the dent. <laughs> look at the dent. Okay, so this, I'm gonna tell you right now before I tell you again, okay? If there's one thing you're gonna get from this video, it's this Rose, Rose 01 Swiss Arabian perfume. If you love Delina exclusive, mm, this is tenfold better, okay? Oh my God, I already wore this twice and the two times I wore it, I gave the links out to whoever asked me. They were like, oh my God, we need the link to this. And I was like, here you go. But this was in person. I didn't really talk about it. This perfume is worth every penny. If you want to smell irresistible, you go for her. And we're gonna talk more about her later. And since we're in the Middle East type of situation, let me share with you guys something interesting. I already unboxed this because this is my first PR package from Kuwait. It's an abaya. And when I wear this, y'all gonna find out because I'm gonna be everywhere with it. Made in Kuwait. This is a gorgeous, like it's long. It's kind of free size and then it becomes a skirt and a top kind of situation. I don't know how to explain it. I'm gonna leave the girls information there. It's a new Abaya modest fashion brand based out in Kuwait. She has beautiful pieces. And when she sent me this, I was like, oh my God, this is just gorgeous. If you're looking for that Khaliji vibe, you're absolutely gonna love the Abaya collections she has. I'm just obsessed with this. It's just so beautiful, so girly. Um, I do need a scarf that goes with it. But yeah, that's my first Abaya collaboration. <sighs> Listen, I'm gonna leave her Instagram for you guys. Check her out. You're absolutely going to love the stuff she has. Like I'm telling you, if you wanna look like a Khaliji princess, this page is for you, 100%. L'Occitane, they did send me, um, ooh, it's a dry shampoo. Cute. That's how it looks like. Ooh, let's smell her. Ooh, it does smell fresh. Can't wait to try that. Thank you so much, L'Occitane. I've been obsessed with this perfume from Valentino. They sent this to me recently. It's the Born in Roma, but the green one. Like the marketing for this green one, that person that did the marketing needs a raise. It was everywhere. And I was like, oh my God, I need to try this perfume. It smells so beautiful. I don't want to change this into a perfume video, but I'm going to talk about these perfumes um, in a separate video. I just want you to know they are already my favorites. So you know I'm not kidding when I say it on the next video that they are just my latest obsession, okay? And lastly, we have L'Oreal Paris hair care inspired by skincare. Oh my God. 
This is insane. So yeah, it's like different shampoos, ironic acid, texture is creamy. Oh, it's time to pray. Basically, it's hair care that has skincare stuff. Cool. Oh, and I like this. This is so cute. How cute is that? It's that little, like a uh, scalp massager. I'm excited about this stuff. Thank you so much, L'Oreal. I cannot wait to try that. I do, I actually needed hair care stuff. So that's perfect. Um, with that being said, I do have to pray now. Yeah, I'll see you guys later. So many reasons where I want to for you, my love. Now you are one to retire with you, my love. Make it a hit and run. My youth. My, my dinner. You're just so free. All I did. Listen, gingering up yourself before you cook is a necessity. It's just vibes. It's just vibes. I can't explain it. But anyways, good vibes over here. I hope you guys are doing well. I didn't pick up the camera for a hot minute. Back to regular program right now. And I'm going to continue the vlog from where I stopped. With that being said, I actually have a guest on his way. I'm going to make some salmon, some salad, some rice, some potatoes. And that's kind of the theme we're going for today. And um, yeah, 